The pineal gland was one of the last parts of the human brain to be understood by neuroscientists. With the Latin word pinea, which means pine cone, it was first described by the Greek philosopher Galen as glandula pinealis. Later, René Descartes described it as a unique meeting point between body and soul, where all thoughts are formed. It's also known as the third eye, due to the pathway between our two eyes, and it contains physical visual processing cells. But its main function is known as an endocrine gland, to release the sleep hormone melatonin. In darkness, the pineal gland converts the neurotransmitter serotonin to melatonin to control the circadian rhythm of the body. Melatonin is known to control healthy sleep cycles and reduce anxiety and depression. But now it's also been found to affect weight gain, fertility and even tumor suppression. It's even a global antioxidant, released from the digestive system for its anti-inflammatory purposes. Previously, researchers thought the hypothalamus was the conductor of the endocrine system. Today, we know the pineal gland sits above the hypothalamus and signals the pituitary gland to release all of our daytime hormones. But the pineal gland also uses another molecule called dimethyltryptamine. DMT is like serotonin, but it uniquely crosses the special blood-brain barrier that gives it access to the pineal gland. Trials have shown that DMT given to patients can alter their state of consciousness in a similar way. Ancient ceremonies like yoga, meditation and mindfulness focus on activating the pineal gland in humans. Why? That's a mystery scientists are yet to reveal.